Hi there, Oma Faraway here, alias Anira. Well, Gladys and I both took photos, and I've now got some of her photos on my computer, and they don't give me the places and times and bits and pieces of the information I sometimes need, and I have to compare them to mine and sort them out, so it's taken me a little while to get this next video sorted, and uh, not to mention the fact that I'm doing it one-handed, which is a real pain. I've uh, had a small operation on my hand. Well, they t well the operation itself was tiny and thing, but the effects have been huge. And um, I'm now struggling with a wee bit. It's uh, behind schedule. Let's put it that way. Should have been a lot further by now in the healing process, but we're getting there slowly but surely. So anyway, I'm not pathetic or anything, and you know, no need to feel sorry for me. Oh, you're allowed. Send me a bunch of flowers. Nah. <laughs> But anyway, so um, just to pass the time and to ignore my hand, which is what I want to do all the time, uh, I've been working on the next video of our time in Wales. Uh, we're leaving Pausmatic in this one, and we're on our way to and and all there. And then we end up at our hotel, the Bull, I think it's called. The big bull or the red bull or some bull and, um, and we spent two nights there so that was good it was quite funny uh, we had a good time there and a few chats with people and uh lovely and after that we moved on to real but before real and everybody said real! but before we went to real we had some fun okay so pause medic to our next hotel um, and i hope you enjoyed I will enjoy watching this as much as we enjoyed the day trip itself. Okay, enjoy! We had a great trip to our hotel. It was lovely, and um, but very warm. It was a warm day, and we kept the uh, air conditioning going. Our stops were lovely. Really had a ball, <laughs> and uh, yeah, when we drove into that wee town ship, um, we both kind of had this comfortable feel about it, and, and looked at each other and said, "Oh, I could live here." and parked the car, and had a walk around, and went up to the castle, <laughs> where we had a wonderful time, the fall and all. And it just wanted to position itself in a spot to take a particular photo, and she just had to climb there. <laughs> we did have a good laugh. Never mind, that was fun. Uh, no one hurt themselves or anything. It was a great disaster. It looks worse than what it was, but it was just funny. Um, and then we drove on, yes, drove on and uh, got to our hotel, which is very comfortable. It was sort of like a courtyard, and we both had our own little house and uh, our own front door. 
so it was nice to relax a little and we had dinner and did some um, work computer work in the restaurant after we had dinner we were allowed to just sit there and lounge out which is really cool I couldn't copy that uh, live video that we got on the Facebook page but never mind that's okay I did try it and it didn't work um, and so for the rest there was carnival right outside the door. So the next morning after we had our giggle and our coffee and our hat photo, uh, we just stood outside and watched the parade go by, which was really cool. Anyway, we took it easy that day. Went for a walk in the afternoon and uh, yeah, that's when I tripped over the bike. <laughs> it was just one of those painted on the road jobs and I, I think I just couldn't have lifted my feet properly and because of the paint and it's slightly raised I just, I just tripped so when it says watch out for the bikes you know so I oh, never mind I guess you had to be there so we had a great time and um I had a lovely dinner that night and we had a good stay but the next day we knew that we were going to uh, be traveling some more and we thought well you know, we've got to take it easy, us old ducks and pace ourselves. And also, we knew that we were slowly getting to the end of the road and it made us think about the time we were spending together and, yeah, that was really good. And uh, during our time away, we also noticed that um, sometimes the internet was quite slow, which was a bit of a pain. But um, also due to the length and number of photos I had, of the uh, carnival, I did make a short film uh, on my iPad and I'll put it online. It's number 41 from memory. So if you haven't seen it yet, you can always go back and see a bit more. Um, I only just add a few bits in here. But we had a great time. And, um, and yes, we were definitely uh, realising that our precious moments and the uh, adventures we were having were drawing to a close, but we still had time to go. And we certainly look forward to the next day when we were going to relive some more of Annette's memories and uh, arrive at our next destination, which was Rill, an other B&B &B that we visited. So um, roll on Rill and on to our Pelsall period, which was lovely too. Okay. Well, for now, Glad is signing off, resting her hand, and uh, see you again soon.